Welcome everybody. Uh, this is the Urban Watcher and today, as you can see, we're going to be broadcasting and recording Guacamele, uh, the Gold Edition. It's a uh, newish, uh, highly rated uh, platformer. Uh, one of the things that, that attracted uh, me to this game was a friend of a friend and I uh, are very, very much connected into the 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 heart and the history of uh, Central and South America. I'm uh, originally from El Salvador, and, and my good friend Kaz uh, is rumored to be from Chile. And uh, we thought we'd uh, have a laugh or two and go through and play this game from beginning on the end. But before we do that, I kind of wanted to do you know a first 10, 15 minute first impression of Guacamele and see. You know, kind of get used to the controls. If uh, you know, if if you, as you're watching this, like what you see, uh, feel free and uh, send send me, ask me questions, or, or communicate with me. If you want to join in on the chat, there's a, a Teamspeak channel available at the top of your right of your screen, and it's set open to the public. It's uh, it's hosted by uh, Geezers in Arms, which is an older. Um, gaming, uh, professional kind of, kind of gaming organization. Uh, members are, include uh, our people over 25 years of age and from all over the world in different time zones and it's uh, no cost membership and anybody can join so you're more than welcome to do that. We also have a blog, um, something we've been putting up, a pet project. Several of us are working on news articles and interviews and game reviews and things, things like that. And that's uh, theurbanwatcher.blogspot.com, and of course we have our YouTube channel uh, that you might want to uh, check out. We have several videos of, of the geezers and playing through all sorts of games. So one of the things I've noticed immediately from uh, from opening the game up is just the bright, bright graphics, the the colors, the the style. So this is something that I've heard to expect throughout the entire uh, uh, gameplay, so I look forward to that. Alright, so let's go ahead and get this start and see what, what we have uh, ahead of us. So I have to hit enter to continue. And Juan, Juan, wake up, Juan! So somebody, I'm apparently asleep. I see a, a looks like a luchador, maybe with an at, with wings and a health bar to the left. I don't see very much else on the screen. And we have a guy that looks possibly like he's from a ship. Okay, so far the controls don't feel too clunky. <clears throat> I love the art. Look at this. Candles. Anybody that's from a Latino background uh, will certainly have, even if they don't have it in their home, will be, uh, <laughs> will, will enjoy the quick little references to the luchadors up in the corner and the little candles on the right. It's a, it's a big thing. And we have a wheat. Oh, ooh, look at the little spider webs on the top. Alright, so I go upstairs, There's, it looks like there's tequila, there's a furnace, some stuff burning in the furnace, a distillery. Okay, this guy likes to drink tequila or something. Okay, so let's push up. You're finally awake! Noon is upon us! The sun's at, it, at its zenith. Very advanced vocabulary. No time, no time to sleep the day away. The Dia de los Muertos festival is nigh. I guess in Spanish this would sound like, uh, No debes estar durmiendo ahora. El festival de los Dias de los Muertos es ahora, en la noche, por la noche. And he waits for a response. Uh, take, take some time to compose yourself. I could use your strong arms at the church once you've brushed your teeth. Hmm. You have strong arms. My, how nice arms you have there. Hmm. Okay, so... The monk likes me. And he goes away. 
and I can't move and do anything. I can walk around. Oh, tab? Tab, okay. So there looks like to be some type of map that I can't really see much, so I'm gonna walk around. Okay. I can jump. So far I can punch. Inventory keys don't do anything if, if there is one. Okay, looks like we're loading another part of the map. And the church is apparently just around the uh, other side of the hill. I like the music. Very nice. Look at the artwork. Uh, kind of subdued in the background with the accented bell. The music. El Mansion, the field, the forest. W. Let me see if I can turn down a little bit of the sound. It's kind of blowing me out. That is amazing. They have it in multiple languages. Okay, hopefully that's better. Juan, I have a festival soon and I don't want to be short on tequila. Okay, Juan apparently is the tequila man. Oh, sorry, Juan. I'd love to invite you, but it's luchadores only. There's this little Mexican town idolizes luchadores. You know, that's actually not far from, uh, in terms of the history and the culture of the luchador. They have the heroes, they have the, the heels, the heroes, and, uh, oh my god, it's just like a, an acted out melodrama back. So how do I get up here? It's true, I was real mamacita in the old days. Okay, so this is an old... Oh, <laughs> little... You better believe it. Is she coming on to me? Is this the church? This looks like it's the church. Hola, Juan. Thanks for coming to help. I'm trying to clear some space in here. We're expecting people to come from all over for the festival. Even El Presidente's daughter has returned from La Universidad de Santa Lucita. Hmm, Saint Little Wrestle. Enough gossip. Could you bust up these empty wine barrels over there in the corner? Attack. And I press A. Oh, awesome. What strength! I knew you had it in you. Hmm. El Presidente's daughter always said she saw your potential as well. Such a nice girl. And I'm so glad that El, Emba Emba El Ambassador's son is out of the picture. Why were they dating? Him and El Cabinet's minister's wife. What a scandal! Oh, crap. Hablando del Rey de Roma. Look who appears! Hola, Frey. I... Oh! Juan! Frey asked me to stop by today. I didn't expect you to be here. Juan, you look so... Uh, re remember when we were kids? We used to get into so much trouble together. Wow, that feels like a so long ago now. You've really... Um, grown up. Uh, um, fix my hair, sway my hips a little bit, stick up. Okay, here we go. Anyway, Frey, I found those chairs you were asking about. I'll bring them over later. 
Bon, could you come by the mansion and help me carry them? I really love to spend some time with you. If you want, maybe we could even go to the festival together. I should go. Hope to see you later, Juan. Bye, Frey. And she leaves. Hey, Juan. Didn't you hear what she said? Now's your chance. Oh, ho, 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 ho. this is better than watching my telenovelas. My characters are developing as the game goes on to people, so you yeah, kind of have to give me a chance here. Whoa! How many times do I have to tell those kids not to play with fireworks? What I was saying... Yes, yes. El Presidente's daughter. You should really go and see her. Go to the mansion to talk to, to the President's daughter. Okay. And... What was the map in M? What was map? Oh god. Map. W. T. R. Oh god. I'll figure it out. Why? Mm. Oh, I pushed something. Is it tab? Yeah, it's tab. Um, I have to go up and then left. Okay, so far I love the artwork. I love the cross. I love the style. The music is good. The controls are pretty easy to use. I mean, this is much more than what I thought it was going to be. Hey! Hey, Juan! What's up? Some chairs for the festival. Sure, I'm just about... Ay, Dios! El Presidente's mansion is on fire! Do something, Juan! Okay, I guess I'll move that way. There we go. La Mansión del Presidente! <laughs> Have to save the princess! <laughs> oh. <coughs> it's too much smoke! Oh, someone is trying to play hero! Oh, wait, wait, I need a better voice for that. Oh, someone is trying to play hero! You're far from the fields, Agave boy! This is no place for you! Juan! Run now before this ugly skeleton gets you too! Uh, okay, how do you voice a fire guy? Uh... Ha 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 ha! What do we have here? I sure wouldn't mind melting those life of your skull! Gran Kalaka! It would be my pleasure to get rid of this intruder! Leave this one to me, Flame Face. I could use a bit of action today. Silencio! If Jaguar Javier were here, he could be trusted to handle this. Unfortunately, he is occupied. I'll get rid of this puny Himador myself. The living world may have chosen to forget me once, but I won't give them a choice this time. I'm Carlos Calaca, ruler of the dead world, and you, you're not even a luchador. Prepare to die! <laughs> Oh, oh, I can't run. Oh, did he just kill me? Juan, no! Okay, I like this. This is cute. I got an achievement. What? Why all the long faces? Excellent. Okay, so it looks like I am somewhere else. Hmm. Could this be the land of the dead? Okay, so I already see a connection to the, you know, saving the princess trope, and and uh, it's very cool. I like that. Bringing back a mod to Mario. What do we do? Okay, we're gonna go inside the script. And... Uh, can I be 
to bust up anything? No. There's a mask on a statue. Some hot chick with a mask. Greetings, Juan. I am Tostada. <laughs> Tostada's a <of> food! <laughs> Guardian of the mask. How interesting that the mask has revealed itself to you. Kalaka has thrown the universe out of order. You must have some role to play. If you put this mask on, Juan, its power will bring you back to the world of the living. Are you ready? She's a butterface. Put the mask on. Get out of there. And here we go. Oh, a luchador. Yeah. I got another achievement. Viva la red rex resucción. Psst! Luchador over here! Okay. The town is under attack by evil skeletons! They've locked everybody in the church and I fear they intend to burn it to the ground! Please save us! Before you go though, <laughs> a tip. If you ever want to check your current objective, hit tab. Now please, go save the town. I'll keep pretending to be a barrel. Tip. A second player may now join. Press enter or start on this on player 2's assigned controller to play as Tostada. The, crunch, the crunchy tortilla. Rescue Frey and the villagers. Okay, that's one thing I don't like. It, 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 the instructions go away way too fast. Look at the background. Look at the... Uh, perspective it creates by putting the scenery. Anybody that's ever studied theater uh, will, might recognize the uh, the use of the backdrop. There's there's three three or four layers here. You have the four, the first forefront layer in which you move. You have a secondary layer behind it that would act like a, uh, a backdrop or a cutout and then a larger backdrop behind that and then the, the 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 painted sky area. Very good. Okay. Testing out the controls. Here's the church. Get back, you fiend! Help! Help! You there, Luchador, save me from this Esqueleto! How do I do that? Oh, he comes to me. Uh-oh. What's the W? I'm supposed to do that. Oh, I collected money. They've locked all the townsfolk in the water closet. Help us, we're scared, and it smells gross in here. Aye, aye, here they come. Uh oh. They're much hotter than I thought. Oh, okay, so if you press W, you can, you can kind of throw them like a judo chop. Don't let it hit you. Roll into the end of its swipe attack. Shift L. What? Uh, I'm almost dead. Oh. Okay. Roll into the end of its. Am I supposed to hit it?
Okay. Whoa! Don't forget to dodge his attacks. This is much better, much easier with a controller. I got him! One second. Save the day now. Free the town folks from the water closet. Okay. Okay. So I have to go to Santo Lito. Godspeed, Luchador. The world is in need of your help. Oh, who's this guy? The way you dealt with those skeletons was magnifico! Perhaps you could help me with a small problem of mine. My home has become overrun with chickens! Hmm, I just ate a chicken. I don't know why, but they escaped from the pen. Who let the chickens out? Do whatever it takes, just get them back into their pen. Punch them, throw them, it's okay, my chickens are the toughest around. Hmm, okay. Okay, so this is like a mini game. I'm supposed to get them into the pen. I wonder if they stay there. Maybe that went in. Okay, so this is kind of the mini tutorial for how to throw things using the chickens as a, as the object. Okay, I, I get it. Come on. Hey, 
There you go. Oh, look at that, Mouse! That's awesome! <laughs> Do I get a reward for that? I like rewards. Gracias, senor. Finally, my order is restored in mi casa. Here, I noticed that one of the skeletons came through town dropped this. Hopefully, it's of use to you. I'll keep that. It's a piece of a heart. Okay. Gracias for saving the town. I don't know if this is considered stealing. A nuestros campeones. Okay, it's a soccer. Been abandoned for years. People used to say a witch used to live here. True or not, no one wants to live in this house. Okay, can I go in there? Oh. I really wanted to beat the kid. I'm afraid it says that my I'm the best mother in town. Can you dig it? Okay. This looks like secret areas. It's certainly quiet in the house these days. I just can't bring myself to get rid of her favorite toy. So I keep it in the cellar. Uh, how do I get down there? Hmm, there's gotta be a way down there. just be able to jump down there. Is this like a secret? This feels like a secret. There's gotta be an entrance here somewhere. Thank you so much, Lucha. By the way, come to my Lucha Day party if you can. Wink. Wink. I knew it. That's what I was thinking. Organic mushrooms. Organic mushrooms! Huh? This is very much like uh, Mario. I hope Santa Lucita is not under attack by skeletons. You should hurry though the for through the forest and see if the people are okay. <laughs> okay, people. Uh, that's approximately the first ten or fifteen minutes of uh, what is it? Lucha Melee. Interesting name, the Gold Edition, and uh, you know I I have very favorable response. A friend recommended this to me, and uh, we got a copy so that we can play through together. And I think that's what we're gonna do. So look look forward to future videos on uh, on Twitch and on YouTube and on the blog with some um, uh, for impressions, reviews, and t tips and tricks as we try to figure it out, and and uh, I, you know I, I think I would recommend this. It, it's not that hard to play. I, I already like some of the video game references, the art, the music. It's uh, it looks good. I mean it, I'm I'm very impressed. So uh, post comments in the in the bottom. Subscribe, 
follow, do all that mess. Alright, this is Urban Watcher.